Today I will go over the Anytone AT5555N210 meter radio. It is a powerful and versatile option for radio enthusiasts alike. This radio has CTCSS and DCS functionality and a high power output. It is designed to meet the demands of communication on the open road or at home using a power supply. The inclusion of the continuous tone coded squelch system CTCSS and digital coded squelch DCS functionality enhances communication privacy by allowing users to encode and decode signals. What is CTCSS and DCS? CTCSS stands for Continuous Tone Coded Squelch System, and it is a method used in radio communication to reduce the annoyance of listening to unwanted transmissions or interference. CTCSS is often referred to as a sub audible tone or PL tone, although it's important to note that CTCSS is a form of signal encoding rather than an audible tone. When a radio transmitter sends a signal, it includes an inaudible sub-audible tone along with the audio. This tone is typically below the range of human hearing. The receiving radio is equipped with a CTCSS decoder. This decoder filters out signals that do not include the specific sub-audible tone associated with the desired communication channel. Unwanted signals or transmissions without the correct CTCSS tone are effectively filtered out, allowing only those transmissions with the matching tone to be heard. The use of CTCSS is common in scenarios where multiple users or groups share the same radio frequency. By employing CTCSS, each group can use the same frequency without interfering with one another. DCS stands for Digital Coded Squelch, and it is a method used in radio communication to provide selective squelching or muting of unwanted signals. Like CTCSS, Continuous Tone Coded Squelch System, DCS aims to improve the efficiency of communication by reducing interference from other users on the same frequency. When a radio transmitter sends a signal, it includes a digital code along with the audio. This digital code is a unique identifier for the specific communication channel. The receiving radio is equipped with a DCS decoder. This decoder is programmed to recognize and respond to the specific digital code associated with the desired communication channel. So all that said, Anyone on the frequency can still hear your conversation, but you will not be able to hear the unwanted transmission. It does not decrypt your voice. It just keeps other unwanted people from interfering with you and the other transmission that you're talking to. The Anytone AT2 delivers a robust power output of 60 watts, ensuring reliable long-distance communication even in challenging terrains. The frequency range is 28 MHz to 29.7 MHz. This radio also includes the weather and weather alerts. If you are wondering if this transceiver can be modded for CB11 meters, you will need the programming cable and it's done with software. You will have to do further reviewing for that modification. I suggest not doing this if you do not know what you are doing. Please note that it does not come with the cable, and you must buy that separately. I will put the link in the description. This transceiver also has single side band functionality that enables users to communicate over longer distances with improved efficiency and reduced signal bandwidth. The radio features a large, easy-to-read LCD, providing clear visibility of essential information such as frequency, channel, and signal strength. The built-in standing wave ratio SWR meter allows users to tune their antenna for optimal performance, ensuring efficient power transfer and minimizing signal reflections. Let's go over the pros and cons, starting with the pros. The AT2 caters to a wide audience, from truckers to amateur radio operators, thanks to its diverse functionality. The high power output ensures reliable communication in various conditions, making it suitable for long distance and off-road travel. The large LCD and intuitive controls make the radio easy to operate, even for those new to mobile communication. The radio is built with durability in mind, capable of withstanding the rigors of trucking environments. Now the cons of the radio, there is no backlight on the buttons, and the microphone is not all that good. It may be bulkier and heavier compared to some other mobile radios, which could be a consideration for those prioritizing portability. With advanced features, there may be a learning curve for users unfamiliar with the intricacies of CTCSS and DCS, including single sideband and other advanced functions. While feature-packed, the AT2 might have a higher initial cost compared to simpler models, which could be a factor for budget-conscious users. The Anytone AT2 does stand out as a robust and feature-rich communication tool for those on the move or just want to try something new for a hobby. With its high power output, versatile functionality, and durable design, 
It caters to truckers and radio enthusiasts seeking reliable and efficient communication. While it may have a learning curve and considerations regarding size and cost, the benefits and pros position it as a strong contender in the world of mobile radios. Always remember transmitting on a ham radio is illegal without a proper license unless it's an emergency. Thanks for watching. The link will be in the description for further reviewing. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel.